This is an encouragement reading for Sagittarius. This is, let's see, your goddess card, which is Himicate. I believe she is the goddess of nocturnal nightfall. Um, she's usually seen with two dogs, two deers, two rabbits, like two skunks, you know. But she takes care of, like, all the nocturnal animals. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. She's like the pipe piper of, like, protecting, like, the nocturnal animals. Anyway, so it says the in-between. So this is probably in-between some type of event in your life, personal event, um, or kind of life and death type stuff, which is interesting. So... This is kind of a person that's either a spouse, a friend, a person in your life. Um, some some type of relationship stuff, okay? It could also be a secret admirer, too. It doesn't have to be a spouse. But um, usually it's voiced in, like, advice or encouragement. Um, and with uh, Himicade here... I, I would think that it would be more of like a protection type of thing or, you know, some type of information that you need to know. Alright, so we have the number 19, which is on this card right here. And we have intuition needs imagination. So this could kind of be in your mind or in somebody else's mind. It could be a bit of a role play, which happens. So, let's see. Uh, let's see. Channel message. I hope you do not regret anything in life. I want to tell you how much I appreciate you and your efforts in keeping the relationship, marriage, uh, healthy and happy. Life is too short to think too much about trivial things. I am proud to show you off at gatherings and show how proud... I am to call you my wife or husband. You are going to be okay planning a great weekend um, away for us, but the destination will be a surprise. Um, in your favorite movie, The Fate in Our Stars, they say you don't get to choose uh, if you get hurt in this world. But you do have some say in who hurts you. That is just how I feel about you every day. Thank you for being in my life and making it brighter every day. Thank you for placing your trust in me and helping me understand where I'm going wrong. This long distance relationship is not the easiest. But I want you to know that I love you and I am counting the days until I get to see you again. Quitting a job you don't like was probably the best decision you ever took. You got this. You will figure this out either together or apart. Um, thank you for always being by my side and helping me grow in life. It requires... A lot of it's a great deal of tolerance and not just love in um, a sustaining a marriage or a relationship I will remember I still remember our first date the first time I laid eyes on you while arguments in our relationship can be common Is more about how you handle the differences that make the marriage strong. The past year has not been the easiest with me losing my job due to the pandemic, but you have really managed things perfectly. Love you much. Uh, sun, happiness, simple joys. So this is kind of like this person poured their heart out. This is probably the longest letter I've ever channeled in my life. But this, um, 
as person is is kind of like you know you don't have to worry about any of that stuff and this could be like they're writing this in a dream and that's how I channeled it because purple um, and nocturnal stuff but I feel like when you're asleep this person thinks about you they could live on like literally the other side of like the country or in a different country so like they're they're trying to talk to you through messages or dreams, things to that nature, but they want to do something really nice for you. So they're, they're coming around to the point of, oh, I need to, you know, either plan a trip or buy them something nice or, you know, at least tell them that I'm thinking about them, you know, type of thing. Because I feel like you're worried about a lot of different things at the moment and probably financially. So... Could be anyone from a friend to a romantic relationship to a relative, actually. So it could be all the above, too. So it's that's a lot. A lot of people trying to, you know, talk to you. All right. So anyway, Sagittarius, hopefully this helps you out in some way, shape, or form. Um, take care of yourself. Take care of your family, friends, and... Um, do something nice for yourself. I'll see you in the next reading, alright? Later.